back up. Y'all be good. Uh, you good. Um, can I get this right quick? Yeah. This is 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7. For Yahweh have not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. And, and one thing y'all got to know about Jake's man, we, we, like, we, like the scripture said, we are much more mightier than they, man. Like, that's one thing that I was trying to, like, get into, not really to switch up topic, but I ain't fear the devil when he steps up on me, man. Like, most people, they either want to get carnal or they want to back down, like, straight up. It is what it is, y'all. Little, little, little devil don't know what I'm capable of, bro. Oh, yeah, I know. Like, hey, like this dude, this dude yeah, a strong yeah. dude, man. Oh, yeah, okay. like, this dude a strong, but, strong but, dude. But, but, but the scriptures say, have not fear, man. Fear, fear. Some brothers will tell you, like, fear is a sickness, man. Like the brother was bringing out earlier, you fear don't have to fear that. Fear ain't real. You, yeah, you don't have to fear don't whatever situation you're going. It was a, a situation uh, just a week ago where I had a big ass shotgun pulled out straight yeah, to my face. And man, I ain't, you feel me? Like, you don't supposed to fear that shit. And truthfully, it's a choice. Uh, to, to die for the Lord is, 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 is great game, huh? So, truthfully, to do it with the Father and not be on this hellhole no more is better than, you know. And it's beautiful that that you know that fear is just a choice. Yes, and that's why we always say a dangerous situation is real, but you don't gotta fear that. What's, what's, what, what goes on? And that's why I, I, I say men, and this is kind of switches type of when men are better jobs because women are panic. They when, panic when it, it's they because you know it get cold up here, the ice and shit. Uh -huh, but women it. are scared out. They they take their hands off the wheel. Like why the fuck would you cover your face instead of trying to fix it? Yeah, yeah. You got an airbag. You ain't gotta worry about that shit because because or you got the Lord because what your mind is doing, your mind is playing out a situation. Like, uh, that, 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 that never even happened. It happened. It, it never happened. Exactly. It, it's not even real. You just yeah, planted it on your head. Right. It didn't happen in reality. Huh. That's why fear is illusion. So, 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 man, you're right, man. You're right. Well, okay. Revelation. Uh, you, I got the most two things. Give me Revelation 21, verse 6. Is it 21 and 6? Yeah. This is Revelation chapter 21, verse 6. And I have heard, as it were, the voice of a great multitude, and as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of a mighty thundering, saying, what's it say, hallelujah? Is that supposed to be like, uh, that word, Yeah, hallelujah. That's all I think it's supposed to be. Hallelujah, for the Lord, Jehovah, omnipotent, reigneth. Let us be glad and rejoice and give honor to him, for the marriage of the Lamb is come, and his wife hath made herself ready. And to her was granted that she should be arrayed and find linen clean and white. No, no, um. You said what? It's 21 verse 6. Oh, select it, select it, select it. Yeah, I'm actually, that's a good one too, though. But... My fault, that was a, <laughs> that's the Roman numerals, man. My yeah, 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 them Roman numerals. Up, it's 21 verse 6, bring that back. Uh, and he said unto me, it is done, I am Alpha and Omega, uh -huh. the beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life stop, freely. Stop. Yeah, so right, that water is talking about, like I said, the, the, the knowledge of the Bible, man. Okay? Because um, he went to the Samaritan woman, came to him, and she was like, um, he was playing to her, look, I got water that um, you'll never thirst again. She was like, what is this word you talking about? And it was, it was the word, man. All right, because Ephesians like what six and twenty one tell you that this word is like water. Out of his belly shall flow living rivers of living water. That shit can physically happen. Like motherfucker, like <laughs> pour out their water. You no know, mass. That's their own um, hip talk, man. Go ahead, hip talk. And then, um, Verse seven. Uh -huh. He that overcometh shall inherit all things, uh -huh. and I will be his God, and right. he shall be my son. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah, um, the, the overcoming of what, man? The overcoming of all this hell that's about to happen here on earth, man. It's about to be chaotic as fuck, man. Okay? That's why the Lord said, um, shall, I, shall, I find, shall there be faith on earth when I come? All right, so we got to hold fast that word, man, that we believe in Yahweh about Shema and we ain't going to take this damn devil on um, chip, man. Okay? Or we, like, we ain't going to, um, whatever thing he come at us with, man. We're going to stay believing. How about you? Shut up, man. Can I, can I, can I, can I, can I keep going? Yeah, I want you to keep going there and get whatever you're about to bring up. This, this is uh, verse 8. Uh -huh. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and murderers and whoremongers and sorcerers and idolaters and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. All right, yeah, so the second death is nuclear fire. The first death was it down on um, the flood, man, okay? But um, it said the fearful, man, okay? 
We can't be fearful, man. Like, fuck this. I mean, cool you're going to be nervous because the Lord was even nervous, man, when he was about to be put on that cross. It's, the scriptures say you that, um, that the fucking sweat was dripping down, like, off his damn face, like blood, man. So, so, because what? As a matter of fact, I got to get this. We're going to have to play the two seed. We're going to have to play the No. That's right. We might have to Hey, I dropped that uh, revelation by accident. I ain't know if it was done, but I can't forget. Well, this though, is this good. is Proverbs chapter 27, verse 1. Boast not thyself of tomorrow, for thou knowest not what a day may bring forth. So um basically you gotta be in the spirit of, of always saying like you're willing because of the simple fact that you never know what tomorrow may bring. But I wanted to also get this here, which was kind of on topic at the time, and I wanted to bring it out. But uh, this is Proverbs 12 and 31. It says, Proverbs 21 and 31, it says, The horse is prepared against the day of battle, but safety is of the Lord. So, safety is of the Lord. No matter, like, really what you prep yourself for, the safety is of the Lord. And, and in these latter days, the only way that you're going to get safety is if you, if you, uh, the scripture said, this is, uh, we run to the Lord, he is a hot, he is a, a strong tower. Like, when we call upon his name, it is a strong tower. Like, we run, we seek to the Lord for it. We hide ourselves in the scripture. Because we know damn well we ain't got the right money, mechanic, uh, technological things to, to use to stand up against these devils. The only way it is the Lord, right? And that's why he said the business is his, because they got everything and they benefit and they power and they right mind right now. Right? Hell no! Everything that's against them. Yeah, we recording, man. Get the get out the way, bro. What's your nationality, bro? He are uh, Hebrew. He is. He Hebrew. You said Hawaiian. What, that's your father. Your father's Hawaiian. No, I'm Hawaiian. I'm saying, what is your father? I'm Hawaiian. What's your father? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it does matter. All right, have a nice day. Well, you gonna be a slave in that kingdom? Have a nice day. I'm not gonna be a slave. I haven't been a slave. You gonna be a slave in kingdom forever, man? You know what? Back in the day, you know what? He drunk. He a drunkard, bro. Yeah, he he drunk, drunk, man. Have a nice day, bro. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. If you ain't native to Hawaii, then you're a Howard. How come you don't know about what you're talking about? Now you're talking about me. Alright, this is first No, I don't want to say what I got to say. Y'all are saying what y'all want to say. Chapter 2. We'll start at 1. No, I don't want to say. Wherefore, lying aside, all malice and all... You know? You know? It's First Peter 2 and 1. Wherefore, lying aside all malice and all guile and hypocrisy and envy and evil speaking, as newborn babes desire the sincere milk of the word, that ye may grow thereby. Yeah, desire the sincere milk of the Lord, man. <laughs> I'll give you some distractions because I'm sorry, man. Give, give me all Lamentations on oh, 4 verse 20, man. What you mean? Now I'm good. <laughs> oh, oh, give me all oh, Ezekiel 25 verse 12, man. <laughs> like, the Spirit just switched. Yeah, 25 and 12? Yeah, 25 and 12, man. Because he's deep down white people, man. I think we're supposed to be able to Come on, man. The ass is going down, man. Lamentations. Fucking faggot. Yes, I wish that be glad. Oh, hold on. Give me that one. This is Lamentatious. Right. Uh, I'm going to start at 4 verse uh, 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 tw uh, 21. Yeah. Rejoice and be glad, oh daughter of Edom. Yeah, daughter of Edom is you so-called white people, man. Y'all asses is going to slurry after this bitch get blown up by nuclear missiles, man. Good. So enjoy your last time. Enjoy your last happy holidays and shit. Because we're going to be bashing your fucking kids in the head when that dollar collapse, man. Man, I, man they fed our children to alligators, bro. I want to do the same shit. You know, drop their ass in a, in a gorilla pen. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> and record that shit. You do it like what um, uh, Goodfellas did when Tommy took him in a trunk. He stabbed his ass yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Uh, that dwell up in the land of us. <laughs> the cup also shall be passed through unto thee. Uh -huh. Thou shall be drunken and thou shalt make thyself naked. Yeah, you're going to be drunken. Man, 
Rejoice, oh, be glad, oh, daughter of, the, of Edom, uh -huh. that dwelleth in the land of us. Keep going. The cup also shall pass through unto thee, and thou shalt be drunk, and shall make thyself naked. Yeah, so these, these fucking crackers, man, they, they ass is, is about to be tasted of that, um, they about to be the prey, man. Y'all right. about to be the new niggas, man. Oh, yeah. Okay? Like I said, man, we gonna be chasing y'all so-called white people down. We gonna be lynching y'all asses, man. Y'all better be ready for that shit, man. Huh. Okay? Because... Like that racial tension is, is is stirred up, man. It's all across <laughs> um America, man. Wait till you, all right. Yeah, and these crackers, man. Like I said, man. They they trying to get bold, man. But <clears throat> when 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 this shit break down, when your cops, man. All right, man. Tell me, man. On that day, your ass is gonna be it's gonna be a bloodbath, man. Appreciate like, that motherfucker. Wait till he got all the way down there to say. Yeah, get 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 some. Uh, Jeremiah, Jeremiah, fifty one and six. Flee out the midst of. Babylon and and deliver every man his soul. Be not cut off in her iniquity. For this is the time of the Lord vengeance. He will render her, he, he will render unto her a recompense. Babylon has been a golden cup in the Lord's hand. Have made all the all the earth drunken. The nations have drunk of her wine, therefore the nations are mad. Yeah, the nations mad, they they <coughs> They drunk, they follow America. America been set up so long and been on top, which, in which the persons that run America is stem crackers, man. So I don't give a damn how many times they say, oh, Obama's a black president, you guys got equal rights. Get the fuck out of here, man. If that's if that's the damn case, how come y'all get shooters off, shooters and get get off scot free, man? That's a goddamn lie, man. All right. So that's that's why, man. When this this dollar fucking collapse, man. I'm telling you, man. You white people better be on the fucking run, man. You better be on the fucking run, man. Cause ain't, man, niggas ain't about to. We ain't got that trembling heart in those slave days and goddamn um Jim Crow, um what's called, Plans, yeah Jim Crow laws and shit during that time, man. All that um places versus first and shit, man. We ready to get at your fucking neck, man. All right, hey, man. Judah, fuck the real, the, the, the fuck. Judah, the Negroes kind of ready. We just waiting on the other tribes, bro. Yeah. Judah already kind of hyped up, man. I can see. I, can I say you this though? Can I say this though? Can I say this though? Yeah. Not, not, not to rebuttal a bit, yeah. but you know, Scripture did say, "Who shall rouse him up?" Yeah. So basically, saying we right now is a sleeping yeah. mind. But if you look in the other countries where our people still dwell, say for example Venezuela and all that shit, where they actually standing up against the, the powers that be in their land, yeah. you know what I'm saying? They already full force pledged. They actually, it's kind of vice versa too. They actually waiting on our people too to kick it up. But you know, that's waiting on the Lord. So we actually waiting on the Lord. And yeah, when the yeah, Lord yeah. comes, that's what we going to rise right, up. Right. Yeah, but and you know, it's, it's lucky. But right. they also say Judah is who his brethren shall praise, man. We are going to be the ones that's going to jump on these motherfuckers first. Yeah. Then the northern tribes is going to start following after us. Because we the head tribe. That's why I say that. Gas shall come at last. Yeah, okay. And gas is gonna come for us with some shit for you damn Edomites. Yeah, yeah, they already cussed you on that. Yeah. Scalping your ass. Yeah. Doing all kind of shit for your motherfucker. I got this, uh, this is Ezekiel chapter 25, verse 12. That said the Lord Jehovah, because that Edom have dealt against the house of Judah by taking vengeance and have greatly offended and revenged himself upon them. Therefore, thus saith the Lord Jehovah, I will also stretch out my hand upon Edom and cut off man and beast from it. And I will make it desolate from Timon, and they of the dawn shall fall by the sword. And I will lay my vengeance upon Edom by the hand of my people yeah. Israel, and they shall do it Edom according to my anger and according to my fury. Oh, yeah. They shall know my vengeance, saith the Lord Jehovah. Yeah, we can't, uh, so like it, bro, we can't get mad as the most high can. Uh, you know, yeah, as mad as we get, we, we can't fucking get mad. And that's mad why I wanted to say something. Uh, brother was bringing this out, and they was talking about how you'll be done slayed like 10 Edomites and think that that's it. But the Lord said you'll do it according to my anger. He might be able to say, no, dude, you got 90 no more to go for the day. You got to do 100 a day, you feel me? That's according yeah. to my anger. You ain't doing 10 and you break it down. All the shit they did to you. He said, you're going to do according to my anger. We can't get as mad as the Lord. And not only that, he bottling it up. Now, what happens when you so, when you swallow stuff and you keep bottling it up? And it, and it oh, yeah, build yeah, up. Yeah, you feel yeah. me? He uh, building it up. He said, many a time have he, turned, have he thought to destroy us as a people. Because, look, this, this Jeremiah 49 and 12. For thus said the Lord, behold, those who judge us not to drink of the cup have a suddenly drunk 
if thou art yeah. right, thou that shall it's cool all to over. together it's go unpunished, uh -huh. thou shalt know not go unpunished. Oh, thou shalt surely drink of it, man. Yeah, man. Okay. Yeah.